representing the Whoa Whoa Dojo. He is a 68 degree black belt in karate. Sensei Joey. No. your Golden Kid Champion. Well, let's go ahead and bring out his competitor here tonight. Making his way to the ring. At six foot, seven inches tall and weighing 316 pounds. He is the master and the ruler of the universe, Brutal Rob Heads. The Broody Man, one of my best friends, and he is ready for fucking business as only a Brutal Rob Hands can be. You may think that you've seen hands, but you've never seen brutal hands. Especially not brutal Rob hands. Daring a hole through his former compatriot, Sensei Nugs, and the big man stepping over the top rope with ease. Like it was nothing. We have two giants here tonight, 20. We are going to see some big guy shit tonight. We got two of the biggest big guys. This is going to be a fucking hoss battle for sure. And that is what it's all about. Your golden king. The richest prize in all of Hood Slam history and possibly human history. Two giants, two Adonises, two Atlases squaring off. And we're underway here tonight in your main event of Hood Slam Tombstone Polydrive. This match has been brewing for a long time. And brutal Rob Hands calling for a Greco Roman knuckle lock. And they have locked knuckles. Testing the strength of these two human specimens. Bringing their hands into the air. Ah. Knuckles are locked. Grecos are Roman. And we are underway in this contest. Who? is the stronger of these two gigantic men. Brutal Rob bending at the knee, suffering the effects, taking the knee to the mat, 
The big man struggling back to his feet. He is trying to gain leverage, bending the wrists, squeezing the fingies of Sensei Nugs. Oh, oh. that off to a knee in pain. That's right. Holy shit is right, you one person. That one person was spot on the nail because it takes a lot to bring the coach to his knee. Uh-oh, but coach now. Coach now, squeezing, squeezing upon the fucking carpals and metatarsals or whatever is his fucking fingers, phalanges, I don't know. You were right with carpals. Both men taking the knees, struggling against each other. They are both to the floor. They are fucking squeezing hands, and dollars are being thrown, they're rolling. Rolling, possibly out of the ring. Look the out. fuck out at the apron. And then out onto the their floor. Feet. Never breaking the knuckle lock, suffering the effects of the grip strength. This is the most karate style knuckle lock I've ever seen. Whoa, whoa, Dojo. Oh! Holy shit, did you see that squeeze take nuts to his fucking knees? I didn't mean to rhyme, but I'm glad I did. Sometimes you rhyme and sometimes a 316-pound brutal rob squeezes your fist. Oh, and they're fucking slowly rolling back into the ring. Never breaking the contact, never releasing the holds. Both men struggling for the upper hand, literally here tonight in your main event. If you've never been in a Greco-Roman knuckle lock, it's a lot like holding hands only. Oh, huge punch to the forehead. Then a second one. Those gigantic ham hocks. Are just, just going to do uh -oh. Scoop! No! It's, it's gonna, gonna take a lot to pick up the coach, no. the sensei. He hurt his giant back. These two behemoths. Uh oh, now Nugs! Scoop! Oh, he's no! Go! He was too heavy. Can't get him up. And Broody Man. Six the first to his feet. That's not true, whoever said that. They're wrong. They're, they're wrong in a bad way because these two giants are as bad as they come. Squaring off here. Exchanging. Could be going for another attempt at that scoop slam. No! Oh, six foot seven, 316 pounds. The big man, Brutal Rob Hans, goes for the cover. Two. Oh. And the sensei kicks out using the martial arts experience, the awareness to escape the pain in the nick of time. Huge fist drop right to the cranium skull. The most vulnerable part of the cranium. Oh! Gigantic elbow drop, all of his body weight across the solar plexus. Oh! Right again in the Juno. Gigantic elbows, one, two, only two. Coach tosses him off like a wet doll. <laughs> a wet doll. A wet doll, 20, because the wet doll gets tossed the fuck off. That's, that's what I do with my wet dolls, I toss them off. As do we all, and as did the coach to Brutal Rob here tonight in your main event. I would like to point out that Coach Nugs doesn't just take shots, he headbutts you in the fist. If you're gonna punch me, I'm gonna fucking make you work for it. No! Huge cane upside your face! Case in point, the coach is gonna make you work for any fucking thing at his period. Jeez! Criminy! Come on, you big son of a bitch! Big strike from Brutal Rob. Oh, every day is caning day. No! Oh, and Nugs retreating to the corner, trying to stay on his feet. Charging in. Oh! Huge avalanche splash in the corner. Oh, 
followed by a second one. Mike O'Shea, I don't know how much more Nugs can take. The coach can take oh! a lot, 20. Three gigantic splashes. It's a lot of splashes, but the sensei has been splashed before. And he's no! He's gotten elbowed. elbowed before. No! It's going to take a lot. And the Bruti man is just going to work upon Sensei Nugs. Who is the man? You are the man. We are live and we are pals. Charging in, back oh. elbow. Not enough to take the big man off his feet. Oh, flips his hair back. And a second elbow. Watch out. No. Oh, takes his seat, thinks about his life decisions. I'm going to say some of them were good. And Broody Man, huge cane. And, and another. And a third one. Oh, four canes to the coach. No! Oh, that was the biggest of big boots. And Broody Man charging in. Ow! Boot right to the mush of the sensei, Coach it. Joey Nuts. Big guy shit! Oh! Huge boot right under the jawbone. Picks the up the sensei by the nape. The nape. Hey, another, a third off the ropes. Go! Don't oh, close that thing. Both men down, but Broody Man struggling first to get to his feet. Off the ropes. Oh, and another double clothesline. Struggling to their feet, both competitors here tonight, giving their all in your main event. They are leaving it all upon the canvas, but they are up again. Broody off the ropes. No, holy short. Third double close line. With an L, devastating both competitors. They are devastated. That's not good. Broody pointing toward the corner. What could this mean? No, Broody, no. Broody, I don't know that we've reinforced the ring. He's going up. Making the ascent of the ring ropes. Brutal Rob hands going to the high red district. Unfamiliar territory for someone so fucking gigantic. I don't know if the ropes can support his weight, 20. He's up. 16 pounds on the top rope. He Bounce is up. Precariously. Oh my God. He's getting. Get. Oh. Rey Mysterio splash off the top. He got all of that one, 20. Holy shit! Whoa, whoa, Dojo Disciple, Heartbreak Ken out here on the ringside. What is he doing out here? Urging his sensei to his feet. But Brutal Rob Hands calling for the end. Could be signaling for that fucking one handed gigantic choke slam. He's got He's him got goozled. Him. What the fuck? What are you HPK. doing? Oh, he gets oh, caught! Double goozle! Breaks the hold! Super, Super kick. kick! World's Nuggets! Oh, yeah. shit! One, two, three! Here is your winner, and still your Golden Gig Champion, Coach Sensei! Huge victory.
Let's hear it for your winner and still Golden Gate champion, the sensei of the Wow Wow Dojo, Joey No! You know, Mike O'Shea, in this business, we may say that something was a huge victory. But when you got two gigantic giants in the ring, huge victory doesn't cut it. That was a gigantic victory for Sensei Nux. It indeed was gigantic, monumental, the Golden Gate champion, the Sensei defending his title here tonight in your main event.